Okay, now what? Rock, paper, scissors for it? Okay. That's fair. On three? Yeah. One, two, three. I threw paper. I threw a rock. That guy did get the beer, but he also got a five-year sentence for attempted murder. Low five. Rule two. Remember that it's not only men that drink beer. Is there anything more intimate than when your eyes meet across a crowded bar? Oh, hang on. I guess that's more intimate. Honestly, if you want to give me something nice, just buy me a pack of peanuts. Obviously, just buy a new pint. You're literally at the bar. Also, that isn't how digestion works. That eyeball isn't reappearing there. Rule three. Show that if it's a choice between common sense and alcohol, you know which way men will go. What are you doing? Should we pick him up? He has Bud Light. He has an axe. But he has Bud Light. And an axe. Well, I'm sure there's a reason for it. Hey, buddy. What's with the axe? It's a bottle opener. Hop in. Refreshingly smooth Bud Light. Always worth it. Look, he has Bud Light. And a chainsaw. <laughs> Rule four, if you're charged with advertising a soft drink, don't forget to appeal to toughness, just because your punters aren't drinking beer. This bloke's foraging for berries in the beautiful Swedish countryside. Surprisingly dangerous, when you consider a bear could rip your face off at any moment. Luckily, that bear is nowhere near his beloved berries, so his face will remain intact. Even if his arm won't. Aye, aye, aye. Very impressive and all, but why didn't he just pick it up with his other hand? Alco Pops are also keen to appeal to our macho side. Ouch. Why do I suddenly fancy a kebab? Uh, looks like you got a little nick there. What, this? It's nothing. Maybe we should get it looked at. Or maybe we should go get a delicious Mike's Hard Lemonade instead. <laughs> You're on. Funnily enough, I'd rather have a pole shoved through my middle than order an alcoholic lemonade in front of a workmate. <laughs> Finally, rule five, which is ignore all the other rules and make an advert that's so weird and unsettling, people have to drink loads of your beer just to forget it. Two questions. Why is she trimming her toenails in a restaurant, and why does no one mind? I'll have the fish. Don't worry about the fish. They're best out of here. One fly that's just desperate for this all to be over. You know how you feel, mate. I didn't see that coming. Well, he's definitely not getting a tip. And now for some good taste. What a bloody elaborate walk for that tagline. 